We recorded most of the show before going to the Red Dress concert. Uh huh. And now this is directly after. Yeah. So we thought we'd pop back on and say what a good time we had. Certainly, uh, you look lovely. You Thank rocked. You. you understood the assignment. Well, you know, I'm never going to the Met Gala, so I figured. Let's treat this as if I am. Yeah. Well, and also, you know how much I love some theatrics and costuming, so anytime I can throw together a fun little outfit for, you know, some ditty, of course I'm gonna. So this was the Ermac Red Dress concert with Cirque de Symphony, mm -hmm. and it was five different performers who all did just fantastic moves. Right. And they did exactly what you said they were going to do. They did the, the hoop mm -hmm. that was hanging. The lira. They did the hoop that was on the ground. Uh-huh. The sear. And then they did the silks. Uh-huh. And they Good did job. a duet with a man and a woman. Which I totally had a feeling they would. And I'm actually pretty positive that I've seen that same man and woman perform before, at least the guy. He looked really familiar, and there's something about his style that's pretty unmistakable. Did you recognize his abs? I was actually <laughs> looking more at, at, his at his traps. Yeah. Those, okay, here's the thing. People don't really think much about those, but that's the muscle that you develop if you're doing acrobatics. I just want to say that uh, IF Symphony, what's up in their 74th season now? Right. They've gotten better. Way better. Last time I saw them was like five years ago, and mm -hmm. they did Beethoven's Ninth, which is tough anyway. It is. It is. Especially the final choral movement. Right. Ode to Joy. But... Um, there were a few sour notes that I remember. Right. And they just nailed it tonight. And and they did they some were challenging crisp. Rimsky, Korsakov mm -hmm. type mm -hmm. stuff. Yeah. Yeah, they did like circusy type music. Mm -hmm. They so did. It was kind of like including a, the Harry Potter theme, by the way. Yeah. Which was so fun. It was like a pops concert, which I love. You know I love when, mm -hmm. when you play the hits. Right. They had these great little Macrons. I wish I would have kept the box. I don't remember you who did it. You and your Macrons. I, I love me a Macron. <laughs> and I love that they're finally getting real fancy with this, just the way I like it. So anyway, we had a great time at the Not Quite Enough Room for Your Knees <laughs> Theater Center for the Performing <laughs> Arts. Yeah. You know how hard my dad no, fought? No, it's fine. It's great. And we had great seats too, this time mm -hmm. in the balcony. Which is really the best place to watch but, any acro show, dude. Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely agreed. Mm -hmm. So thanks, Ermac. Thank you, uh, Idaho Falls Symphony conductor Thomas Heuser. Mm -hmm. It's been a minute since we've talked, but uh, he's a great guy. Right. And he did a great job tonight, and so did the entire symphony. He did. He was really fun. I, I liked the part when he uh, joined in with the acrobats. I thought, that, I thought that was just a hoot and a holler. Yeah, they did a little bit together. Yeah. And on the note of thanking... Thanks, Dad. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, thanks for the tickets. <laughs> so, Ermac Red Dress Concert comes around in February every year. You are IFAF this week. Crisp mm -hmm. high five. Whoosh, 21 finger gun salute. Pew, pew. And <laughs> chef's kiss to you. To you. And all the ladies wearing the red dresses tonight. Right. Well, any dresses. We went to Spoken Fins right before, and we saw so many people in red dresses. <laughs> and I was like... Clearly, we found the hot spot tonight. Right, I feel like yeah, yeah. half the uh, half the people inside Smoke and Fins were wearing red dresses. Right, this dress reminds me so much of the one that Sarah wears in the labyrinth during the masquerade scene with David Bowie. God damn that <laughs> that scene! As a kid, like that was what I wanted every. That's what I wanted every single party to be like as an adult. And then I became an adult, and I was like, oh, this sucks. You know, Carly, <laughs> you remind me of the babe. Oh, the baby with the power? Yes. <laughs> <laughs>